we're at Wormslow Historical Park. I think I'm saying that right. Um, we're about to go get our tickets here. This place looks so beautiful. We're gonna show you some of the trees and stuff like that. But apparently there's a family that lives here and they've been here for eight generations. And they allowed the, the place to become a park too, but they live on a slither of it. So pretty neat. Yeah, it's like 300 years, I think. Uh, yeah, like 300 years. Worth of people. <laughs> yeah, so well, let's go outside and we'll go get our tickets. Yeah, that was quite the adventure. It's a, what, a five minute drive probably. And uh, it just, it kind of made me think about what it would have been like in horse and buggy. I mean, that was, you yeah. know, quite a, quite a bit of distance. And it was probably really exciting when you were arriving on the plantation. On the property, you also get free admission to the museum, and they got a lot of artifacts from like 100 years ago. And it tells you a little bit about the Jones family. This is their property, and um, the, I guess the the first Jones was his name was Noble Jones. This is money. Apparently, their money was extremely big back then. I've been business a long time. They give you this nifty little map. Okay, so right now we're about to head that way. And apparently there is the ta Tabby Ruins, as it's called. And then there's the Jones Family Gravesite. So we're gonna go check out both of those. Let's go. Let's go. Yeah. I spy an oak tree. And then show them. Where did we get those? At the gift shop, right? Yes. Yes. So the kids can have something to do while they're walking. Behind me is the Tabby Ruins. This was actually Noble Jones's house. It would have had eight foot walls and it would have gone all the way around here. It looks like they say it was a five room house on the plaque and um, the, the, the eight foot walls would have been for protection from Spanish and Native Americans. So um, it looks like it's in ruins now, but this is where the Jones' first home would have been. The original gravesite of Noble Jones is just beyond the shell midden. It's like a workout. Greetings from Crab World. That one's asking for money. He's like, money, money, money. Oh, Nikolai, there's your bird. Look up. So apparently 
this was used to be the family graveyard, but the great grandson um, called G W J Durang, I think that's what it says here. Um, he had the remains moved to the Bonaventure um, Cemetery, so this is what's left of what used to be the family gravesite. So now we're on our way to the Colonial Life Area. So behind me they have a little observational deck so you can look at the marshes and uh, sight see a little. <laughs> Okay, so if you look on your map, there's something called Colonial Life. And as you can see, it's a little setup. They got a blacksmith area. There's a cannon there. And a little um, old house behind me. And I'm not sure what that is. We'll have to go take a look little at pen. it. Yeah, let's go take a look at it. There's nothing in it besides water. Okay, so we figured out we figured out what it was. It's actually a stove or an oven and it's pretty smart considering it gets to be like 100 degrees sometimes in the south. We just cook outside. To shade it. And shade it. Yeah. It's a nice cool cooking area. Mm. <laughs> So it looks like it says here it's 2.3 miles. On the map it says 3 miles. So this is probably not something we're going to do today, but we'll take a little stroll down here for a few seconds just to see what it looks like. Yeah. So we just stumbled onto the living camp. It was a lot closer than we thought it was going to be. But uh, it's pretty neat. And I got this over here. That one's actually got skin on it. Yeah, let's go take a look at it. You really had to be okay with nature and bugs and snakes and spiders. Although if that's the campfire pile, I feel like you're asking for the right? tent. <laughs> so your tent will catch on fire. Right. Okay, so this wraps up our tour of Wormslow Historical Site. Featuring the Jones family. Yeah, definitely. It's a nice little area. A nice little hike. Not too rough, right? Yeah, it was. It was. Uh, it was actually peaceful. I mean, I don't know. We didn't really get to go do the three mile hike. Yeah. I mean, I guess it could have been a little more rough. We did not bring the proper stuff with us today. No. For hiking. No, and we wanted to show the place off more than anything. I'm sure it was a lot of woods, and it can get a little boring showing that. Yeah. I'm sure most of you wouldn't want to watch me recording the same footage over and over again. So, but um, I think that'll be it, um, you know. Yeah, so if you liked this video, yeah. please hit that like and subscribe button and leave a comment below. Yeah. And Thank you for watching. We're going to go get some lunch now because we're hungry. Yeah, you know us, we have to eat after everything. <laughs> <laughs> but we hope you enjoyed and we'll see you on the next one. Yep, Till next time.